there, everyone. I just wanted to say that I've been to my uh, first day at Coop Camp, which is here in Glendale, Arizona this year. And it's a weekend of all things chicken, and it's sponsored by Coop Dreams, and which is a TV show. We don't get it because we don't have TV. But, <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, it's nonetheless, it's out there should you be interested in watching it. And they talk a lot about chicken coops and things. So this weekend is a gathering of uh, people in Arizona who want to learn more about chickens and all kinds of fun things about chickens. Tonight was a social where we met a lot of the people who will, who will be speaking over the weekend. And what else did we do? Oh, we had food if we wanted. That was fun. We also got to visit the marketplace. People were selling all kinds of fun little chickeny things. I actually saw at the... Um, one of the tables, they had a chicken purse. You know you know what I'm talking about, guys, that chicken purse that everybody's got. Yeah, they had a silent auction for that chicken purse. And then they had little mini coin purses, too. But, but I digress. I'll, I'll talk about what went on. Uh, basically, we uh, were introduced to um, some of the speakers, which was, which was kind of fun. We'll meet them all in depth over the weekend, obviously. And... Most of it was just social, and honestly, the most time tonight was spent on watching two chickens poop. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. They were playing chicken bingo, and the idea was people bought numbers for the little bingo board that they put on the floor, and they put two chickens in a little run-out pen, and we just watched and waited them to poop waited for them to poop on the numbers so so disappointed i missed that <laughs> i know i know it was I, I was actually like you know this is what it feels like when i'm trying to take poop samples at home which is like could you poop already <laughs> but they but they actually did poop and two women two women won so that was cool they're gonna do the third round tomorrow i did not does the winner get the poop the, no no the, one of the winners got an incubator i can't remember what the first winter got, but the second winter got an incubator, so that was kind of cool. Anyway, I'm losing my voice, so I'm going to speed this up, because otherwise I'm not going to be able to talk at all. But uh, what one of the things we got was uh, Neutrina, a little egg carton. I'm not exactly sure if it's, I think it's like a reusable one. It's plastic, and I'm not sure if there's anything special about it yet. I didn't, didn't ask or anything, but I thought that was pretty cool. I got my own little egg carton they gave coupons and some information and for those of you who remember i used to always exclusively feed neutrina to gypsy that was her equine senior that she absolutely loved so have not tried the chicken version of the neutrina chicken food yet so maybe that's you know a little incentive with the coupon that's cool so that's what i wanted to show you this was you basically you walk to the tables and see what they have and this was this was hey fun free stuff so that was cool and we got a bunch of little brochures and things oh yes okay i finally got to meet michelle she's a a coven of cackling hens oh Aww. and unfortunately i only have one day at coop camp this was a gift from my mom and brother for christmas and i get a well, one day today plus the one day. i mean yeah day. today it's yeah. like a two day burn but um so anyway i'll be there saturday so tomorrow but the social was open to everybody tonight. Now, the exciting thing was we got a goodie bag, okay? But this was way at the end. We had to wait to the end. And I didn't even open it yet, and I'm so excited about it. But anyway, one of the cool things was there is a gentleman named Chad Prather who does a lot of social commentaries and chicken things on, on YouTube. And he is now one of the... I don't know what you would call it. I don't know if it's a sponsor or maybe an endorsed buy or whatever. But he, this is our picture here, I had to meet him because he he's, does some cool stuff on YouTube. And he's now doing uh, coops for troops. They're going to start giving um, chickens and chicken coops to, to um, injured or uh, disabled veterans. So that's, that's really, cool. really, really cool. We get to do a little vote thing. They've got little little jars and we get to put pennies and stuff in them to see who's going to who's going to like win the the chicken so i thought that was pretty cool anyway coolness <laughs> ah free samples and i can't even open the bag so we'll just tear it ah! <laughs> bad joints are not... okay so what is this this is this is the first thing organic feed free sample by new country organics so that looks fun it looks like there's a lot of little chips of seeds and dried peas and corn 
Looks like there's, looks like there's, I don't know if it's crumbles or something. Anyway, that's, that's cool. It's organic soy free. So, cool, fun stuff. Um, so you don't have to pay for the soy. This, oh, what is this? This is so cool. <laughs> I love getting free things. <laughs> Look at this. It's a little eggcartons.com, a little chicky bin. <laughs> <laughs> Because I just, and it looks like a little lanyard too. Hmm. Eggcartons.com. I have not checked them out. I will go check them out. What else do we got in here? Put some fun in your chicken coop. Here's $5 off your order. Foul play. Hmm. Oh, look what that is. It's the chicken swing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm a crazy chicken. Uh, you know, that that's, I, I have to respect that name. The... It's toys for chickens, foul play. Foul I mean, play. I, I, okay, you know. okay, so this is interesting. Sierra Sage, 100% natural green goo, animal first aid and salve. I've oh. actually heard of this before. How's it, it smell? Actually, it doesn't really smell, which is good because I'm not a very. Let me smell it. Cameraman's going to smell. It smells like sap, right? It's it's pretty mild. It's, yeah, yeah, it's very mild. It's nice. I don't know what's in it. Of I'm not sure what that be. smell is, but it's a anti, very mild smell. Antibacterial, antifungal. Okay, this is green goo. Ooh. Now green I'm ex goo. now I've heard so much about this, and I've actually heard you can get free samples of this. This is grublies, and everybody is talking about this. It's it looks like mealworms. It's oh black. Black soldier fly larva. Huh. We're gonna try this. My my girls. Let me take like, a look at that. Yeah, my girls like live things, so that looks like it's dehydrated things. We'll see how that how that goes. I don't. I mean, black soldier fly larva, and maybe it's something that's a gourmet delicacy to <laughs> chickens. But I don't People, see how it's not just regular dried mealworms. I, it doesn't look like... And, and usually your chickens are very spoiled. They don't very, like the dried stuff. Picky. So this will be an interesting test, and I'll probably video this too. You know, we should. We, we should, we should we'll do a taste we'll test. We'll see what happens, and we'll report back to the company and let them know. You know, and, it, and if, they, if they do like that, yeah. we should go afterwards and run around with just plain old dried mealworms. And see if they will go for those. Because, yeah. I mean, if they like grubblies but hate the mealworms, then grubblies might be yeah. something extra. Yeah. I don't right. know what it, what's extra. I just, I'm just opening this. You're seeing it the first time I am. Here's something. <laughs> Grubbly farms. Grubbly farms. Yeah. Here's something from Purina. This is... This is what this is what I buy, and there's a two dollar coupon on the back here. Uh, I call it Purina Chicky Chow. If you're in the marketing department at Purina, Purina Chicky <laughs> Chow. Got some news for you. Uh, we buy the mostly the Laina pellets because they like that. They also like the crumbles, but Purina Chicky Chow. Chicky Chow. Giving you free ideas here, folks. Poultry solutions. This is looks, that where you dissolve poultry? Didn't that stuff. <laughs> this is really cool. Okay, fine. We're gonna have a look at this. It's a catalog of chickeny things. <sighs> I can't wait to look through this, man. This is and a five dollar off coupon too. So oh, that's cool. Okay, I'm five dollars off of what? Space here. Okay, what else do we have? We have Countryside mm. Bookstore, pioneering the simple life. So this looks like looks like a homesteading kind of thing. I don't know. Mm. It's got a lot of books. Books about raising animals. That's cool. What do we got here? Incubators and accessories. Ooh, with special promotions from Coop Camp. We won't say show that. <laughs> won't show that out loud. Uh, this is incubators, so that's cool. And actually, they gave away an incubator tonight. I don't know if it's this company, but but there was one. Okay, Cull Plastic Cull Corporation. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. A lot of this stuff I've not heard of because I just have chickens and whatever kind of materials I can get away with because we don't have uh, extra lots of money for, for things. So this looks like this is a bunch of eggs, egg stuff, watering stations. What is that? What is this? I saw pheasants. What is this? Oh, okay. I saw it's for, for when your pheasants are misbehaving. <laughs> Okay, lots of boxes it's a and things. problem I run into all the time. Yes. Okay, what is it? Oh, this is called 
countryside. And it says, a, and small stock journal magazine. Have not seen this before. So have a good look at that. What do we got? Oh, Chicken Math Club. A little ad for Chicken Math in Arizona. I don't know what, what Chicken the, Math oh, is. Okay, I was about to ask. Chicken <laughs> Math is if you have something like 10 chickens, you really only have two chickens. Because you, you can know, also. You I've know, heard like, variations on like this. Like if chickens yeah. aren't laying eggs, they don't count. So, you know, <laughs> so right now I have maybe, maybe. So it's kind of like if you're a crazy cat lady and you have an indoor outdoor cat, if it's out of the house, technically it may never come back, so it doesn't count as one of your cats. You know, that's how it goes. That so this sort of thing. So this last one, this is really interesting because I can't remember if I got this yet or not. Backyard poultry. I actually, hmm. in one of the chicken groups that I'm in, I won a free subscription to this through one of my Halloween dress-up contest thingies. So, um, so I don't know if I have this one yet or not. I'll have to look. But this is a fun little, fun little magazine. So, so that is everything that was in the goodie bag. And I got to get going to sleep because tomorrow is a big day. It's going to be full of lectures and workshops chickens. and chickens. <laughs> And they're going to do a coop camp photo at noon. So, but anyway, that's my only day. So I can't report on Sunday, but I wanted to show you fun stuff that's there. Are you going to do a Sunday report too? My Sunday will report will be, I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> or, or cleaning out the coops after the rain. We're supposed to get a lot of rain tomorrow. And that's mm. going to be a mess. So I'm not looking forward to that part of it. But yeah. So anyway, hi to everyone out there who I met tonight and, and I'll uh, give you a report tomorrow. So. Yay! Have